Hello Heavy Metal Maidens and Masters, I'm Heavy Metal Mama and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have a casual Necessary Evil haul for you. But before we get to that, remember to like this video, comment down below to discuss any of the things that come up in this video, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, it really, really helps. And hit that notification bell so that you can find out whenever I upload. So, Necessary Evil haul. The lovely people at Kate's Clothing sent me another little Necessary Evil haul. This is actually the first part because they sent me a, a huge Necessary Evil haul, but I had to split it up because it was just too much. The video would have been too long. So I thought I would split it into casual and less casual. So today we are doing casual. Now, I picked up a couple of things myself as well from Kate's Clothing, uh, mainly because I realized that uh, a lot of what they'd sent me was tops and I didn't have that many trousers. So I thought, I'd better pick myself some up some <laughs> I thought I'd better pick myself up some trousers. Now, they've been having a clearance sale at Kate's Clothing, and as I was going through the clearance sale stuff, there was this top, which is the Lucinia layered mesh top. It was two ninety nine. Two pounds ninety nine. Unfortunately, I think it is now sold out. I mean, that's the point of a clearance sale. They want to clear it out. But for a, a you know, for a, a vesty type top, which will look amazing with the anti-brand mermaid trousers that I've got here. I apologize for the creases. I have been wearing them because they're so lovely. Look, they've got this iridescent sparkliness to them. And they've got these awesome little mermaid flaps on the side and stuff. They're, they're really nice, really clever little detail. Zip up the side, they're stretchy. These were £4.50. £4.50. I mean, you know, it meant that, you know, you've got an outfit for under a tenner. Under a tenner. So I just thought I would show you those things. I don't think either of them are available anymore, sadly. But that's the point of a clearance sale, isn't it? They wanted to clear it out and they have succeeded. But if you are new to goth or you're just, you know, a bit strapped for cash, clearance sales are amazing. Also, with it being the spooky month, Halloween, all those cheapy, normal people websites, you know, boohoo, I want one of those, I got it first or something like that. They've all got so much Halloween stuff on and it's really, really cheap. But yeah, for sort of basic pieces, keep an eye on the clearance sales. You would be surprised at the amazing items that you can get. And I will be wearing these trousers pretty much throughout the whole uh, the whole video because uh, they go with almost everything else that I've got. So those are the two items that I purchased onto the things that were gifted to me by the lovely people at Kate's Clothing. Love you guys, by the way. Thank you so much, thank you. Right, now the first one is the Soline Velvet Long Length Top. Now, I actually bought this a about two and a half years ago. This is an older piece from an older collection. I bought it in a small, tried it on. I didn't like the way that it sort of clung to my belly, so I just sent it back. They said to me that they wanted to send it to me, and I said, fine, could you send it to me in a medium instead? Because normally they just send me everything in a small. And they said, yes, that's fine, that's fine. Um, and it looks amazing. It looks amazing sized up. It's this beautiful, it's their go-to velvet. It's really warm, it's really stretchy. It's elasticated across the top here. So it basically sits as a, what I would call a bardo top. So you wear it off the shoulder or you can wear it on one shoulder and off the other, which my, I find mine tends to gravitate like that anyway. But where it's a bit oversized, it just looks so sort of slouchy and relaxed. It's a great, really, really casual piece, rather than, you know, sometimes I do look like, look, like to look quite polished, but sometimes I just want to go to the supermarket and be comfortable, but still look goth. And this, this piece does that in spades. It has thumb holes. It has thumb holes. You know how much I love a thumb hole. Who doesn't love a thumb hole? I mean, you know. And it really helps with it sitting off the shoulder as well. It's quite functional in that because it's tethered at your thumbs, they don't keep riding back up. I also found though, because I went a size up, it doesn't keep riding up, which I've had with other tops from different brands that are Bardo style. You sort of, I've got one that it's Creepsville 666 one, I think, and I wear it to work and eventually it sort of sits up here and it looks more like a, a boat neck top. Um, I mean, I think that's because it's old now and I think the cotton's just contracting a bit. 
this top is beautiful it's really snugly warm as well which is great for this season and i think it's quite clever because where it's really snugly warm but then you're showing off that shoulders you don't get too hot because you're not like up to here in in velvet but you don't you, you know so you've got that that cooling but you're also not getting too cold because it's only a little bit of your shoulders that's poking out so this is great also where i sized up it beautifully skims over the tummy so if i'm having a really bloated belly day this top just looks fantastic if you were short i'm five foot three i could get away with it as a dress i am too old to get away with it as a dress i do not want to have that much of my legs showing but if you are younger or you're just that confident you know go for it you know it will it only just comes below your butt cheeks but if you've got fantastic legs and you want to show them off you wear it as a dress it's it's amazing I, i'm sure there's a picture of riri phillips wearing it as a dress you know because that girl she can so but yeah absolutely love this this is the celine velvet long length top and it's in the sale at the moment as well if you want to hop onto kate's clothing's website it is beautiful the one thing i would say about it is it's very generously cut under the armpits sort of thing sometimes i think if you buy a small and it's supposed to be tight it does make it look a bit weird but that's why i wanted to size up because it just gives it that over oversized slouchiness um it almost gives it a bat wing quality as well which i love i mean as you can see it's a really cool piece it looks really great on and you know like i said really good casual piece love it right the next item Again, it's one that I'd seen on the website and always ignored. And it turns out, when it turned up, I was confused. I was really confused. This is the Vesta, oh, hang on, the Vesta Plunge Cowl Neck Top. Now, this is one hell of a plunge. I mean, I can't wear this with just a bra. If you have got really great boobs and some boob tape, you can wear it with a bra. I've got a velvet bra that I can wear it with because it sort of sticks to the velvet kind of thing because you get that what I call the velvet Velcro effect. Um, and so it does just cling to your boobs, but if you turn the wrong way, your whole boob will be out. Um, so I wear it with, you know, a little crop top underneath, just like that. And it looks magnificent. It's, again, skims across your belly. And because it's got this plunge here with these ruchings in, even if you've got quite a pronounced belly, it sort of skims over it and gives you the illusion that it's not there. Um, it's got these ties at the back. Because when I got it, I stupidly just assumed it was part of the packaging. And I undid all the ties and put them in the bin. Thank God I didn't cut them. Um, and then I went on the website because I was like, I'm confused as to how on earth this top fits and realised that they had the ties on. So I quickly got them out of the bin and put them back on. But the idea is that that means that it's adjustable. So you can just adjust where the back is, is pulled in. It's essentially like a basic corseting. So it pulls the back in here. So you can, I mean, if you're really, really big around the belly, you know, if you're pregnant or something, you could just not put it on and it would just generously fit around um at the back again i just you just tweak it so that the shoulders you, if you want you can have it right in it would mean that it came up further that's the thing you can just experiment with how you like to wear it but i must admit i had to go on to the website once this turned up and look at how it was worn i love it with a black top it was so comfortable when i went and got my um my witch tattoo I wore it because it was really light and breezy. It really let the air in. I didn't have to worry about taking it, if I needed to take it off, because I wasn't quite sure what we were going to be doing on the day. I turned up with a load of designs and went, which one do you want to do, Jake? Um, so I wanted something that was mega comfortable, that wasn't tight around my armpits, because I sweat when I get tattooed. It's just my response to being stabbed with needles over and over again. Um, so I wanted to make sure that I didn't have anything that sat around my, my, my armpits. And this top is fabulous absolutely fabulous i will obviously in the depths of winter i'm not going to wear this but it's even great now with it being autumn or spring you can wear it and chuck a cardigan or i wear it with a leather jacket over the top and it looks amazing love it love it love it such a great easy to wear top i mean it takes a little bit of adjusting to get it the right shape for you when you first get it but it's worth the effort really really brilliant top absolutely love it i was really surprised i just had always passed over it on the website 
and I can't sing its praises highly enough now. I'm really, really chuffed with it, but you will need a little vest top. Um, you can wear coloured ones underneath it, whatever you like really, but yeah, fantastic, brilliant top, love it. That is the Vesta Plunge Cowl Neck Top. Right, the next one is another anti-brand item. This is the anti-brand Asymmetric Distressed Skull Fabric Top. Uh, this top, again, it's one of those ones that I'd seen and just gone, yeah, yeah, cool, okay. The pictures on the website don't do the fabric justice at all. So I'm gonna see if I can get it close to you. It's got these beautiful skulls. Can you see them? There we go. In the fabric, and then it's got these distressed bits that hang down. It's so delicate, it's so soft. I thought it was gonna be really nylon-y from the look on the website. I was thinking, oh, it's gonna be like that really scratchy lace. It's so soft, so soft. Doesn't have any stretch. Well, it, no, it has a tiny bit of stretch, but it's, it's, yeah, there's a little bit of stretch in it. Not a lot. So don't expect it to be really, really stretchy jersey or something like that. But it is beautiful. I love the way that it's got this asymmetric um, neckline and then it's mirrored at the bottom. So it's really flattering. You could wear it with a long vest underneath it. You could wear it with, I wear it with a little short crop top. And then I'm wearing it with the um, Maurice Capri pants by Necessary Evil. I love those trousers. Just gives you a little, a little peekaboo of, of skin underneath, but you still feel like your belly's tucked away. <laughs> but again, I would also wear these with the mermaid trousers. I'd wear it with leggings. It's just, it's such a versatile top and it's different. I really like the asymmetrical top, especially where I've got a sleeve, a tattoo sleeve. I really like being able to show one arm. Um, and and you can just turn it around. It doesn't matter which way around it is. I, I There may have been a tag in it. I, no, I think the tag was on the side. Um, it's also got a teeny tiny little bit of elastic here um, which sits under your armpit so that it doesn't, it's it doesn't it's not gapy but it's not uncomfortable either it's really really cute i love the little cat sleeve that's just really flattering it's a flattering length it's the way that it just um tulips out at the bottom slightly is really really flattering i get loads of compliments when i wear it and it's just something a bit different you know and i cannot stress how soft this fabric is, I was so surprised when it turned up. I definitely wash this one in a laundry bag and sometimes I put it on the, well, on the, it's not the hand wash cycle, but it's the delicates cycle, just because I don't think it would stand up to being really, really harshly treated. But I put a lot of my things that have got lots of zips or whatever in those types of laundry bags anyway. Um, occasionally I do catch my jewelry on it, so, try not to wear things that have got lots of um, like interlocking pieces or anything like that or lots of hooks on them sort of thing because it will get caught in these. Uh, I did get caught on the door handle once when I was wearing it. But that's our sitting room door. The door's just, the doorway's one of these double doorways but it means that if you've only got one door open it's quite narrow and I've got rubbish spatial awareness so I get caught on the door handle more than often. <laughs> It's kind of embarrassing. I'm a grown up, I really shouldn't be <laughs> getting stuck in my own house, but there you are. So this is the anti-brand asymmetric distressed skull fabric top. Beautiful fabric. It's so soft. Love it, love it, love it. And again, this is in the sale, so pick yourself one up. I just, I can't recommend it highly enough. I love it. Right, and the last piece is the Thalia cold shoulder strap top. Again, this is one of those pieces that I saw on the website and it's a picture of Deadly Red wearing it. And I just thought, meh, and sort of passed over it, you know. It looks amazing on. It's so rock chick, you know. I just, it, again, it's one of those pieces that until you see it on a, a normal person, I think you can't appreciate how lovely it is. It's got this lovely keyhole neckline here that they do with these straps the straps on the arms they're so flattering and depending on on how you want it to sit you can either do them up quite tight near the top or have them really loose further down it comes with this belt which is completely detached I mean, it's not attached at all you know so it's great you can use it with other things as well um, and you can wear it if you want or you can not wear it if you want it's brilliant I 
when they said they were sending me this, I was like, oh, okay, cool. I don't have it. Okay. And then when it turned up, I was like, wow, wow, this top. Wow. It, as you can see, it just looks fantastic with a pair of trousers. I, I, again, it's this lovely, soft, slightly stretchy jersey. The buckles and the hardware on it are really good quality, really comfortable. And they just give it that little bit of something extra. And it's so comfortable. Again, it's one of those comfy pieces that, you know, because sometimes some of the pieces that I love, they're not sitting around watching telly or, you know, going out for the day with the kids kind of items. You, you, you will, you know, you can't run jump climb trees in them. You know, they are for looking good but not necessarily being 100% comfortable but that is I don't care about comfort I want to look good a lot of people they want comfort this is comfort <laughs> in fact all of these pieces so comfortable and I yeah it's beautiful really really lovely the straps are made of it's almost like denim like black denim so all the bits that have got the the buckle details on I've got this uh, made of this lovely yeah it's it's like a very lightweight denim um and then this is obviously really really lovely the usual necessary evil jersey lovely stretch drapes really well hangs really nicely comes down to a really nice point on your hip so it's really flattering like i said as with all the other ones skims over that belly and if you're concerned about the belt just don't wear it you know and i love the fact that you know i've got this belt i can wear it with whatever i like you know again it's a great quality belt I can't recommend it highly enough. In fact, all of these pieces, thank you, Kate's Clothing, because I had passed them all over and I'm so glad that you sent them to me because I would have never had them in my life and they're great pieces. I mean, this one as well, you could wear this with a mesh top and take it into winter. It would be brilliant with like a mock neck um, mesh bodysuit like with long sleeves or short sleeves or no sleeves or whatever but it would br brilliantly bring it into winter and it's also really nice in summer because you just have these longer and then you get the breeze under your arms I mean I probably wouldn't wear it if I was like you know in Tenerife or Lanzarote or somewhere quite hot like that but be brilliant on the plane absolutely brilliant yeah love it or if you're in a cave, you know, we, went, we did a couple of days in a cave uh, when we were in, uh, on holiday, you know, this would be brilliant for that sort of thing. I hope you enjoyed those pieces. I have absolutely loved styling them up. Really, really great pieces. Uh, um, let me know down in the comments which item is your favourite. If you have bought the Vesta Plunge Cowl, what did you think? Did it confuse you? Would you now buy it now that you know what to do with it? <laughs> Honestly, can't recommend any of these pieces highly enough. Let me know in the comments if you've got anything that you want to discuss with me. You know I love talking to all of you. Uh, so remember to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Please, 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 please do. We're almost at a thousand and I've got some special announcements coming soon. Uh, hit that notification bell so that you can find out whenever I upload. And remember people, stay heavy.